Probably the most exciting thing that's kept me from vlogging and... How are you gonna say all this with a battery blanket like that? I know. It could, die, it could die any second now. What is this? The penguin bracelet. That's the penguin's bracelet? Yeah. From the aquarium? Yeah. So let's, smart. Let's give it back to him. What? what? Let's yeah. give it back to him? Oh my goodness. You want to go back already? What's up guys? Welcome back. We're not quite ready to talk yet. We've got to get that coffee in us. We've got to get caffeinated and then we'll speak. But. If you haven't already been able to tell, we're at the Bay House. It is spring break for us. We're just about at the end of it. And uh, I guess I'm talking, aren't I? I'm waiting in line at, at Duncan. So, don't got much else to do. But we got a fun day today. Wanted to pick up the camera and bring you guys with us. We know that it's been a very long time since we've vlogged, um, other than Tanner's birthday party. And uh, we're gonna catch up a lot, so. All right, line's moving. Person in front of me is watching something on their phone. Looks YouTube-ish. What if it was Tiff? How crazy would that be? All right, I'm a bit more caffeinated now. Bringing you guys outside to show you the progress on the decks. And also, the swans are here. There used to be two doors here, right? But now we got a window and a door because it just didn't really make sense to have two doors. That way we have more patio space, as you can see. They're still doing the top deck, which is a little frightening, but we put like a blockade there so nobody would go out. Not like they opened that door anyway, but, and then love the color of the new decks. It's kind of like a light tan, and then we're gonna go with black railings and like, kind of like wiring railing. So it's not gonna be up and down like those uh, posts there, those spindles. And then you might remember, it's such a mess down here. The dogs are like trying to find a place to go to the bathroom, but there was a deck here as well, which that'll all be stone. And maybe we can do like a new shower at some point and figure out like a nice seating area down there, but it makes the yard a lot bigger. So super excited. Show you guys the finished product when it's done, but loving how it's coming together. You got him. You want to say? What do you think? Beautiful. A little needs a little more spray. We need a lot of spray. A lot of spray. <laughs> oh boy. Get it, girl. <laughs> All right, we're almost out the door. Where are we going? Roller but skating. I really wanted to go rollerblade. You can rollerblade. There's rollerblade or roller skate rink. What? It's like an event. Hey, mom. And it's like an Easter event. What do they do? And I think someone special might be there, like one of your favorite characters. What is? Um, any, any guesses? You were watching some of it this morning. Not SpongeBob. Bluey. Bluey. Like a like a bluey character skating. Daddy, who? Uh, what is rollerblading like? Um, rollerblading is where the wheels are on a line. Roller skating is like two in the front, two in the back. Okay, so you want to roller skate? Okay.
I gotta go. And we got some barbecue on our shirt. Ah! <laughs> Luckily, I'm do? clean with my feet. Um, yeah. gonna, like, if I can, I'm gonna try like do a uh, like backflip. A backflip. <laughs> <laughs> first time, first time roller skating. We're gonna go for a backflip. And take a picture at ice skating. Take a picture at ice skating. I think that's in the cards. If uh, this one has anything to say about it, I brought I brought my little uh, microphone so. I'm use my phone and, and mic up a little bit. I'm gonna have it. I'm gonna have it. Driest salad of all time from Panera. I have a mic. Sim one put on my dressing. Real quick before we go in, what else have we done on this spring break, guys? So we can remember it. The aquarium. It's like a bunch of squares. Dad, you said aquarium. Uh, aquarium. Aquarium. What else? We went and tried lobster for the first time ever, right? Yeah, not not, not I got crab. Yeah. Wait, and where else did we go? Fancy yeah. Island. Oh yeah. Fancy Island. <laughs> the movies. We did the movies. Kung Fu Panda Four. We've been busy. We're Thank trying you. to do the most for them since and we stayed went home. to the yeah. bay. Only bad thing about and staying home has been the weather. And but it's yeah, it's almost been uh, Easter. Yes. yes. Couple days till Easter. I can't put this on. Right, let's not put our tomorrow, butts in there tonight. because yes. the event's till three. It's one fifteen. So let's go. Well, that was fun, I think. Did you guys have fun roller, yes! roller skating? Yeah. Carter, Carter did. Carter went to a birthday party a couple weeks ago. Not even a couple weeks ago. What was that, like a week ago? Um, and that was his first experience rollerblading. He had a lot of fun roller skating. I can't roller skate. I would never, I don't think I would ever put a pair of roller skates on. Don't, I just don't be think I would. It's not that, it's, it's nothing against it. I just don't think I could do it. I don't know, like it just seems different. Did you just go outside? Did you guys see? I didn't see. Um, yes. Your what? Foxy? No clue. There's Foxy's hat. It was mask. So, I think our time here is done. The dogs are making a mess in here? Chapel, Rylan, no messes. Oh my gosh. Looks like Carter is the one making a mess in here. We're trying to figure out if you went outside or if someone came in and we didn't see them. Just kidding. Yeah. Um, I think we're heading home very soon because we've got stuff to do. I had so much fun skating. Me too. We didn't really get to record that, and the microphone thing was a joke. That did not work because it was so loud and there was so many people. It's in the guest room. No, it is. It is. It's in our secret spot. Oh, you know what? I think I got rid of it. <laughs> April Fool's idea. Okay, I'll buckle her. Buckle and Evie. Ooh. Chapel and I can't believe Ella the dogs left his French fry on the ground. I can't believe. What does that tell us about? Cheese is the question. 
Hi, Chappie. It is cold back here. You have like the air conditioner blasting. Yeah, I'm trying to freeze them out. What are you what talking about? What are you saying? I never hear you be so vocal. Is that Chappie or Rylan? Because Rylan's a vocal. Oh, it's probably Rylan. Rylan's down she here. She can't get past the water. She's like, those Stanley's always in my way. Okay, now I need to get back up here somehow. We're not a mess, guys. I, I didn't promise. get myself any water. What's wrong me with neither. Me? I have no Excuse water. Me, princess. No water. Add a coffee. I think I'm still got some flexibility left at this old age. Oh, really? Hey, All right. We out of here. Peace out, Beach House. We love you. All right, this is our last time eating out for a very long time, guys. All right, we ate out all weekend. We did. Uh, yeah. It was surprisingly nice in there. Really? It smells really good. It do. Tables. It was not surprisingly nice. <laughs> tables. It was, it matched, the inside matched the outside. Listen, if the pizza's good, I'm here for it. Exactly. What are tables? No, no tables. Um, you put mushrooms? Just, I should just stop okay. looking around. There was tables, but uh, yeah. And you were right, it's a frozen gluten-free one. Yes. Okay, I'm excited. Pizza's pizza, right? Sure. All right, so we are home. It's a little after nine. Everyone's so tired. That one's sleeping. Um, Tiff and I are going to, we really want to like catch you guys up on everything. So we got the podcast studio all set up in the basement. Um, tomorrow, we are going to jump on there and just like have a conversation with you guys and catch up tell you where we've been um it's just it's been crazy i can't believe that tanner's birthday party was like the first week of february we haven't vlogged since then it's almost april um and before that it was like a good like two months so we're we're coming back um but we want to tell you guys like where we've been and, and that kind of thing um lots of exciting things but boys are still waiting for me to come in so i'm gonna go in and say goodnight to them. Tiff is with Evie. Evie is super overtired and Tiff's probably gonna fall asleep because surprise, surprise, they didn't sleep very good last night. Like three hours, Tiff's ring said, so. All right, we're gonna pick back up tomorrow, have that chat, and then maybe we'll bring you along for a little bit of Easter day as well. Easter morning, I think they're excited. Why are you guys so excited? I don't know, it's Easter! Jesus! <laughs> Abby? Hey. Are you excited? Yeah? We're going to eat a giant, giant bunny chocolate. What? <laughs> <laughs> No, it's okay. There's nothing to close your eyes for. Carter's a little bit like, uh, where's our Easter baskets? They're always right on the island. So like we told you, you're gonna have to find your Easter baskets through some clues, through a riddle. And the first ones, the, the first one, aren't you glad it's not a banana? Easter bunny. bunny. Oh, but you're smart though. Who wants to hop on this out back? He cannot stop. Um, oh, yeah. I don't get it. Ow. Uh oh. My feet are freezing. Mine too. Oh, Ella got it right away. Good job, Elle. Easter bunny has lots of friends. All over town, this is where. His boy Santa comes down. Alright, so where does Santa come down? Oh, me. What? 
Oh, Ella's hot. Ella's hot. It's not, it's not that. What if you move that whole basket? Oh. <laughs> No. That's my I'm just Tanner Beeston loves to twerk. But <laughs> once in a while, this is where he works. She works. Not. Oh, there's jelly beans in there? <laughs> where did mommy Ew, go? did you really just eat the jelly bean off the toilet seat? I wish. Gross. <laughs> his burritos. But if he eats too much, this is where he goes. Hold your nose. <laughs> <laughs> they are on it. <laughs> is there Easter baskets in there? No! No. no. Yeah. Evie Beeston is back. Easter Bunny. E.B. is back. Man, that bunny is fast. Wish we could get him on the podcast. Okay. What one is his? I can't. Oh, Which I one? Saw. I think this one. Yeah, I know this yeah. one. Yeah. Oh. Carter, what do you think? <laughs> that sky makes bubbles. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jelly beans down. I will pee jelly beans down. Jelly beans down. Abby, uh, no yeah. sugar till after breakfast. Yeah, honey, that's um, uh, your own journal. Tanner. <laughs> Do you like how they're crack charms? <gasps> Nurse Abby. Ah, why is podcast equipment in front of your face? It's about time. <laughs> Hey, Nurse Evie like uh, and Dr. Uh, Ella. I'm not a doctor. My dog is sick. Yeah, you're a veterinarian. Happy Easter! <laughs> so, <laughs> alright, we finally made it. It's a couple days later. What is, what is it's it? A blur. Freaking blur. It's Spring break blur. was a blur. What about you guys? Incredible. Am I, am I talking? Do I need to get closer? No, I think it'll pick it up. But okay. this is our first time. This is Tiff and I's first time down here. Actually, not our first time. Our first time was yesterday <laughs> when we tried to end this, and then Evie took a, what, 20 minute nap? Yeah. Maybe. Is so. that because I wasn't sleeping with her? That's why she woke up. So, our brains, as you can tell, are everywhere. What does it say? Heavy? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Is she awake? She's out. She's asleep or she's, no, she's, she's out of me? Oh my gosh. I guess we're, we're doing this with Evie. And we're back. This is our life. I've got lip gloss on your head. Chapel's gonna do some talking. Hi. Why don't you tell us about your buddy? Is that your chapel voice? Yeah. How do you get to mommy? How do you get me? This is why. Don't touch the microphone, Chappie. Okay. This Ready? is why we stopped vlogging. 
we're in like a really bad pattern with with sleep and that kind of thing. I mean, what else is there? You guys, whoever non click out crew out there has been watching us for four or five years knows that we do not do good with sleep. Why is that? We have a lot of children. I know. Somebody's we're, we're always got miss something. These days. I mean, I won't miss not sleeping. I mean, I don't miss them needing me. Of course. Evie, Evie reading for bed now. Is oh like, my gosh! You can steal. You should steal a clip from my night, night routine. routine. Yeah, oh definitely. I definitely am going to. And um, then my dream last night. What? Oh my gosh! Tiff essentially had a dream about the book. But I didn't know. I woke up this morning. We like are like kind of like just like. How much are you gonna tell them about what happens? <laughs> moving around <laughs> in the not, not the whole thing. Sorry, guys. You'll never know that story. <laughs> moving around in the kitchen, like we just like barely say anything, but we like help each other. Like I'm like stirring the pre workout and the athletic greens, and you're yeah. like pouring something. But then we finally got down to the gym. I was like, I had the weirdest dream last night. Everything in the room was pink. I was like, even the cabinets, the cups. And he was like, the book that you read before bed. I was like, oh. Literally, that's what the book's about. Anyway, um, so we got to recap a little bit. We we had spring break. Spring break was great. We stayed local. Um, we did get down to the Bay House, as you guys saw in this vlog. Um, but we did... What did we do? We tried to make every day, like, something a little bit fun for them. We went to see Troll... No. Kung Fu Panda 4. They um, went to see Trolls with your mom. They went to, to uh, Trolls, like, play with my mom. Um, what else did we That's do? That's what I'm saying. Like, we went roller skating in this vlog. It's literally such a blur. The aquarium was a lot of fun. My mom's um, stuff. Birds. Yeah. Actually, yeah, there's ducks in her pool right now. Guys, Tiff is... Uh, I mean, you guys already know this. From, from the bay and all, but she's such a bird lady with the um, bird feeder on the back window now. It's just like... It's the best. Slightly it, out of control. What? Be real. I mean, you I love You talk about the birds more than I do. I do. All right. I'm a bird guy, too. Um, so then we had to get back, um, you know, with enough time to host Easter and everything. And then, I'm sorry, guys. I'm, I'm not the best at, at vlogging holidays and stuff anymore because like for whatever reason I just I can't I want to pause after sneeze no you're sneezing don't scare it away <laughs> okay I'm scared away now um I just, like for whatever reason I can pick up the camera and vlog certain parts but like it's just you want to be in the moment yeah. you don't want to be thinking about like what shots to get or right like you don't want like somebody to change what they're doing because you take out the camera. Like, I think it's that's just, part of it. Too. We we love you guys and we love vlogging, but it's not our first priority, and that's okay. Like we're our first priority is being parents and yeah. being in the moment with our family, and then when we can, we can. Like you know, the algorithm hates if you're not consistent on YouTube, and that's not. We're not here to get millions of subscribers. We're no. here to share be there for our people and like share when we can. And like we've always said, like the kids love it. Like they love going back and watching different mm -hmm. things. So we we want to, you know, like you think about the the dad with the video camera back in our day. Like grandpa, anybody, yeah, anybody who has that footage. Like happy birthday, grandpa. Oh yes, happy birthday. Ninety one, ninety three. That's I crazy. Check my grandma's Facebook. But like that footage, like. Anything I have from my childhood, like I cherish that. So I want to, I want to give that to them. As I well. literally always remember oh. my grandpa had a huge camera, and like he also, we, any like family holiday, we would watch our old footage and be like, oh my gosh, look, remember that? It exactly, was, it was the best. And like the the raw uncut parts are like are like the best part. So yeah. um, we yeah. have a lot. We obviously we always have our phones out. We always have you know, and we have so much more on our phones than we share on the internet which is amazing like yeah. those are those are the best things to look yeah. back on the kids crack up because it's like you know the little personal moments mm -hmm. but like those are those are so funny so i encourage you guys all to like document as much as you can just to have it for yourself you yeah know? also um why are we here why are we in the podcast room you didn't even talk about podcasts they no. just appeared with these big microphones in our face they were like hi guys 
Yeah. They're like, what is going so, on? Where are you? So We're in the basement in our podcast room. We, I said earlier in this vlog, there's no secret that we have been completely MIA on this channel. Obviously, if you watch Tiff's channel, she's super ultra consistent, always uploading, but like, we decided that we were gonna go, not go a different direction and not vlog, but we wanted to get into podcast because when we do this, when we just like chat and when we can sit down with other people, it's unbelievable. I got put this all together in December and we have not recorded a podcast yet, but that's okay. You went so hard. There was like one week in December and this room was complete. I was like, I love it. And it was a surprise. I didn't see it until the end. Yeah. It's, you know, something that he wanted to do and I love it. Even like love like all your little touches. I love they put your YouTube plaque and the hidden sea wine on the bottom, Got and your eagles. eagles. It's gonna get so more and more. We're just, we're gonna we're gonna put the make but this what's like the goal memory of the lane. Podcast? I don't you know I think trying to help you guys by sharing other people's kind of inspirational stories. I think sitting down with people who are successful in ways, whether it's you know that they've made it in the business world or like whatever they have fifty thousand followers on their dog account. You know what I mean, like their bird watching like something that can make people go oh wow like that's really cool that's a different um avenue of success right like I think when I listen to those types of podcasts I get inspired and think like oh my gosh like there's a lot of ways out there to turn your hobbies into income or just like grow what you're doing right yeah um but so then I was like, oh, that's yet. not it. Like, I don't want to just do that. Like, I want to talk to parents and talk about everything under the sun because that's how I am. I get very off topic at all times. Well, and, you know, it can't. I mean, any, success is undefined, right? Yeah, like, true. someone who has five kids successfully, they could be on our podcast because we could learn from them. Yeah. I mean, I get stressed out having to Big think news, of guys. meals. Just kidding. Kids. No, I mean, while I'm sitting here tracking my macros, trying to go so hard to just get into not just like better shape, but to feel stronger and more energy. Like I have been feeling so old for my age and just dead from not sleeping yeah, right. that like I just I want to prove to myself that I can get stronger. So that's like my main focus, being stronger and having more energy. Everybody just comment and be like, you are such a beast because she is. She's like incredible. Seriously, and she honey. she puts herself down here, but she's she's up there. You're you are. Well, but I want to be there for my kids and my grandkids, so that's selfish. To It's not selfish, but it feels like you're doing something for yourself because my reason is to be around longer and be my best self. Yeah. I mean, yeah. That, that should always be the, the primary focus, and then looking looking hot is secondary, but you already achieved that, so, that's funny. you know. Um, second focus shift that we've kind of encountered was... I decided to get my uh, real estate license, um, mainly because I, I'm obsessed with it, right? Like, I can't stop looking. Ever since we started looking to buy our very first house, like, I've never stopped looking at houses. And there's just literally, there's something about it, the buying selling process that is so enjoyable that I'm like, we could do this, right? Like, I we, always... I believe, truly, you have to dig really deep, and you might not even know until you're in your 70s, but I believe that we're all born with something in us, and you don't necessarily realize what it is for you. Like, for me, it was, since I was five, I can remember pretending I was on a reality show, walking to the bus stop. I would make QVC videos that my parents still have. I always loved being in front of a camera and sharing life and being, like, really realistic and silly, and I never knew. I just thought it was, like, that I'd like to do but it was my passion he has been constantly since I've known him just looking at real estate and we've been together a long time so it wasn't necessarily always on a cell phone right because there wasn't like red fin and things like that we've been uh, together for 15 I used years to, I used to look at work all the time yeah, like any like spare time I had at work websites and, yeah, and then when it was on his phone it was even more frequent yeah yeah I mean it's just you know anybody who's out there in real estate you know like it's it's kind of addicting it's like I don't I, it's like shopping for some people like you see a new thing pop up a new house and you you just want to like see what what why is that house priced like that like yeah. what you know what do they have oh let me see you know and like well, like he's looking you know when I tell you he's been looking at real estate it's not even just in Pennsylvania or New Jersey it's like everywhere yeah so I was just really happy that 
we went on a kick for a while that we were going to move to Florida, but that just, you know, yeah. that didn't I, if my If my families would move to Florida, I would be there in a second, but, like, the alligators, they just scare me. I don't know if I can do it. I'm, and those storms. Those two things were our big deterrents. Yeah. Oh, no. Camera battery. Dang. We got to hurry this up. Anyway, um, I'm not yet licensed because I had a nightmare happen where uh, I had to take the test at 11.30 at night, and then two hours into it, it shut me out, so I rescheduled, and I am, um... Let me just say, I wish I could put this company on blast right now, because, <laughs> but I'm, was an, a I'm a nice person. Um, first, he scheduled his test, which he thought was, like, 11 a.m., 11 p.m., he couldn't change it. The day of, he's, like, all cute, he had his snacks and his coffee ready to take his test, and they're like, um, it's at 11 p.m., so he chose to do the proctored one at home, mm -hmm. and then that night he was on question 100 of 120. I think even like 106. And it I had like shut 20 questions down, minutes. and there's been nobody to speak to. Everyone's like, "Sorry, sir, like you have to take it again." He can't even see what he got so far, like how he did. So okay. now he's doing it in person. I had I had like a a good like 10 day pity party myself and then now I'm like all right whatever. it's just really it hard is what it things is. are just unfair and there's no justice and there's no help and there's no answer it's yeah. really hard to just get over but you immediately to. said like the trials and tribulation like add to the enjoyment of the final it's not just success that. I feel like, like when anything's worth it it's hard it's hard yeah and so even if it's something ridiculous like that the reward is going to be even better I genuinely believe that I was up till literally like three thirty, four o'clock in the morning. And then you got made, sick? Made myself sick from it, but it's all good. So bad. And then probably the most exciting thing that's kept me from vlogging and... How are you going to say all this with the battery blinking like that? I know. Hurry! It could, die, it could die any second now. Hurry. Um, I can't go into too much detail, but we created an app that is in the beta testing phase right now that I think all of you guys are going to love so much. Every person that I talk to about it, like I've pitched it to different places, they all love it. Um, I don't know if people are just too nice to tell me that, that they don't, don't love it. Don't say Lee. Chris and his friend Carrie created it. Well, I so give my input and like things that I like and things I think they should change, but this was 100% your idea. I have nothing to do with this, so you're very really sweet. Thank you. No, you do. I mean, because we found a problem that we had, and it solves that problem. I think a lot of other parents have that same problem, and it's just been like really cool to like talk through it and make it what it is, and yeah, Carrie took the, Man, took the, Carrie. the peanut of an idea and turned it into a monster and like it's it's almost perfect and it's got so much room to grow if you want to like dm me on instagram or something like that and and i can give you a little bit more detail uh depending on you know how you come across eventually you're going to want people to try the app right the right now launch, right like, right, now. right now yeah that's what i'm saying so like, if can't you want to be one of the first people to, to try everyone. the app let's go yeah it's free it's crazy and it's and it's hopefully going to remain free across the board but there's just like so much that we want to offer that we're trying to work through all that but yeah because you need to do like little upgrades and what's it called like you can do premium yeah i mean we're we're not again, there we're, yet we're in the infancy and i know everybody always says this but like it's not for the money it's 100 percent to solve a problem that parents have and if you know it becomes lucrative it's like well i mean i'm not gonna say no but mm -hmm. You know, it's it's a hundred percent like a really, hopefully, really cool thing to help kids, help families, help parents, um, schools, and school, and just just it's it's big. I always that. think that's the best place to start is when you don't even do it for the money. Like YouTube, when I first started, I was like, maybe I'll get a free shirt sometime, and then eventually, remember, and I called you, I was like, it says I have a penny in my account. Yeah, and I was like, I remember exactly out. where I was. Yeah, I was like, oh, you can make money from this. And I said I wasn't gonna buy a camera. I used my cell phone because I was gonna wait till I made enough money from YouTube to purchase a camera because I didn't want to put my hobby and make us like fall behind. I, on the other anything. hand, have put quite a bit of money into this, <laughs> and uh, you know, it's more so, um, you know, if it's an investment. If not, like I said, it's just something that's gonna help people, and that's that's cool. I love that. Yeah. Um, that's what it's all about: helping people, connecting people. And I'm the type of person that if I throw 20 bucks out the window, 
it just comes back. You just have to believe that, like, it's going to come back. And yeah. that's what I believe, you know, so. Me too. All right. We will cut this. Why, why, am, I, why am I so forced? I'm not cut out to be a podcaster, guys. <laughs> <clears throat> Before the camera ends up cutting us off anyway, but... Hope you guys enjoyed our vlog back. We will be a little bit more regular, not promising anything, but we've got fun stuff coming up. We're headed to Great Wolf Lodge this weekend. Yeah. We might steal a couple clips there. We also and are then, gonna have no life in April because we have soccer and now baseball and T ball. So we're basically just gonna be sports yeah. nonstop. But that's so fun. Summer's I'm around the corner. Well, you know, when we're outside and doing things more, it's so much easier to pick up the camera well, and vlog have a little bit. Like, you yeah, know, like, you know, I don't wanna but I don't know. Maybe I'll show you guys some some behind the scenes I stuff like, of our our days as well. I like when you do like little bits here and there because before you'd be like, all right, well I'm vlogging today, and you have to like feel compelled to vlog a whole day, yeah. and that doesn't really work for our family, like little bits and pieces. You guys, let us know what do you want to see from us. So much different.